And we're back to Stellar Interface. Let's get right back into here, guys. We're gonna go to the Corvette, though. All right, I only have 16 gigs of RAM. But he does get, the Corvette does get more unique stuff. All right, so I gotta pick wisely. Calf is actually pretty helpful. But now I don't have enough for anything else. That's the downside, so I gotta pick wisely. All right. So I got 16, go ran. And ran, we're gonna do double ran. Here we go. And I'm ready. All right, so this is what we gotta deal with. Let's get right into it. Actually, ran looks pretty cool. Machine, it's literally machine guns. I like the idea of having machine guns. And like I said before in the previous part, check down below in the description for the Game Jolt game. And look forward to early access coming out soon on their Steam, uh, Steam page. Because they have been greenlit. For a little while now, too. Alright, come on. Ah, and I'm done. Let's try that again. I just gotta be more cautious when I do these things. Oh, see, this is what happens. When you restart, you also lose choices. Or maybe no. Maybe the, the weapon selection is also random, too. So, like, if I went back... Let's pick Lotus. Yeah. I didn't get these choices earlier, so this is definitely random. Okay. Because if you need I choose a Corvette again. Let me go back. I want to see uh, what, what do we get for the mole. Yes, yeah, moles has the same option, but mole has 20% uh, 20 ram. So that's a stronger machine gun, but it's quite powerful in eating up ram. I'm also just stick to calf if I pick a uh, mole. Double calf. Here we go. Ready. So you gotta be careful when you, you start over, because then you lose uh, choices. And like I said, I think maybe the random the weapons are randomly designed too. Because I didn't have this last time. Like I said, the levels could vary too. Like even the enemy uh, dog battles. Are, every dog battle I've had, it's been different if you notice. It has not been the same dog battle. Which is cool. Because, you know, in, like, some games, you get to, you know, fight a lot of encounters, but they're never quite as random. So, definitely want to try to get to the boss. Sorry, I got quiet for a moment. I'm just trying to... So concentrate. There we go. What do we got for choices? Uh, machine gun, blaster, shotguns. Moving faster when hurt. Uh, I'm gonna stick to this. I think that's one that works out better. Wow, okay, we got more options to go to. Level two, level one, level two, level three. Let's stick to level one. We have to build. Yep. Although, I don't know if it's recommended to go higher or lower. I'm thinking lower because I need to upgrade stuff. But yeah, this selection's definitely giving me a lot better idea. And me concentrating on the firing power here. So... This, this will definitely keep my Gunstar Heroes itch going. Because you guys gotta remember, I do love Gunstar Heroes. I think Gunstar Heroes had some really creative stages too, but it was, like I said, mostly shooting, but on, on foot. They only had one space stage that was kind of like this. Ooh! I had an idea. You may take this, you may not run with this. Um, in Gunstar Heroes, they had this kind of like a ship, but it wasn't a ship. It was mostly a meteorite snake that was controlled by like one dude that was sitting on it. And the one dude was only able to like, shoot like one uh, laser at a time, but the 
Mirai Snake would like chase down the ship. Now, I don't know if you could do that with your game, but just an idea I would throw out. It, it'd be a little bit different. Like, it'd be... I wouldn't say it's an actual boss. It would more be like a, like a mini boss. Similar to like how you have like the mini barrage snakes that come through with the, like the lasers. But instead of like it being a ship, it's like a meteorite conglomerate. So, I don't know if that's possible, but it was actually quite uh, fun to fight against and also uh, dodge at the same time. So, okay, we only have level twos and threes. Let's go to, I guess we'll try this level two. Alright, come on. Although I've not gotten any consumables in a while. So I wonder if I can get more consumables later. Destruction. Annihilation. Oblivion. Death. Devastation. Destruction, annihilation. Alright, now they're coming in all directions. Gotta be careful. Although I will miss like the first time I've ever moved like my fingers rapidly and I keep uh not a keypad, but uh, the arrow keys on the computer. Like I said, I'm more used to controller base. Because I grew up with consoles. Oh, I hate you guys. Oh, God. Dodging. Like crazy. Ah. Come on. Work with me, fingers. Come on, come on, come on. Open up, open up, open up. Damn it. Gotta destroy that thing. I'm dying. There we go. I got rid of it. That's helpful. Woo! I didn't think I was gonna survive that one. Okay, cool. Control driver update 1.0 for increased damage and firing for missiles and torpedoes only. Crap. Uh, hitting went faster when hurt. Joy, your spacecraft is fighting fit. We hope to see you again. I want Joy. Joy sounds fun. Oh my god, open up a lot more. Holy crap. That opened up a lot more. Okay. Uh, no. Stick to level two. Let's just see what this is like. Like I said, slowly increase. What is this Joy bug do? That's... Oh. Okay. Oh, I think it's the one that heals. Right. I noticed they did do some changing, though. I'm not seeing the continuous plus signs. I like that touch. Because the, the little green laser is enough to indicate that I'm getting healed. Or a little green string. Alright, that's pretty cool. Dodging. Like crazy. I'm definitely utilizing C a lot more. That's why I'm surviving more. Because there was no way I was going to survive that barrage from earlier, the previous stage. Yep, here we go again. These guys again. Alright. Well, I guess I got the healing bug, so it's okay. Come on. There we go. Because if I take those out, then the barrage kind of ends early. Oh, okay, did not know there was vertical meteorites. That's, that's different. Hello. Gotta dodge, gotta dodge. Why didn't I dodge? All right, Buck, heal me up. There we go. Nice. Missiles Maniacs Digest N2. Warhead deep calibration algorithm for increased damage from missiles and torpedoes only. I think I'm still using machine guns. I could be wrong. I, I can't, I'm not paying attention. That might be helpful. Uh, I like. Well, I'm pretty fast, anyways. Let's go cannon weekly. Okay. 
So, difficult there, difficult there. How are we doing percentage-wise? Uh, that looks easier. Let's go to this one. Okay. Yeah, definitely not as hard, but definitely shooting a little faster. I think last stage was a little harder, but I could be wrong. It could get difficult as we go on. Random. I do like the cost of the, the, uh, the enemy ships. They're, like I said, unique. Oh, God. More meteorites. Not surviving well. Nope. And I died. I lag died, I think. I don't know how that was possible. Crap. Okay. Now, I'm gonna stick to the mole, because it's got the most RAM. In all honesty. What are my choices now? Count one. Blaster. Okay. I like the RAN machine gun. RAN was more useful. But Baruka makes a lot more impact. Mm. I want to be able to maximize, so if I use calf and RAM, that might be helpful. Keep RAM on top. We'll use calf for bottom. Alright, here we go. Not bad. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's a lot different. This is a machine gun blaster mix-up now. So if I get, like, the upgrades for the shotgun blaster machine gun, you know, this will be useful. Although I did see in their gameplay trailer, the game does get crazier with the upgrades. Because I think uh, when I did get to the boss in the, like, very first video, I was honestly surprised how much barrage uh, the boss could do, and you could do that as well. So, just gotta learn. Gotta get good. Get good at uh, space fights. Can I Dark Souls a space battle? I don't know. That'd be interesting. Man, there we go. Yeah, this is supposed to help me increase. Now, I could go for these two, Quick and Mad and Roger. Roger's shield is actually pretty cool, but I'm going to go with Cannon Upgrade. Because I could still get to lower levels here. Yeah, there's still two lower levels I could do. Uh, this one looks easier. Yep. Because if I build the upgrades, it's going to be helpful in the long run. Go. Come on. Yes, eliminate. Like I said, I'm determined to get to a boss. And if I have to, I will kind of like <laughs> jump to it if I need to. But I'm going to try one more time playing through it thoroughly, and if I can't get to it, we'll jump cut to maybe a boss battle when I really get good at this game. Sorry I'm not putting my face directly in front of you guys on the camera. This game does require a little bit of concentration. I think I've said concentration four times now. Okay. Um... We'll still do Sylve uh, Sylve Sylve yeah, Sylvester. Because Sylvester was actually useful too. Yep. Rogers is nice, but this guy actually fires back, so. I have Sylvester still alone right now. Oh, I met uh, Rambo. I met Sylvester. There was no Sylvester still alone. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Yeah, like, I honestly can't believe I'm out of consumables still. I still have not got any consumables. Which I don't know if that's good or bad. Daniel Murr. Daniel Murr. 
love this music. There we go. All right. Like quick rat, speed increase. Bruce, they say it's difficult for him to pass away. Uh, faster dispatches, fire rate increase. Uh, I like increased fire rate. Okay. Let's continue on the. Yeah, I like dealing with the green guys. Faster fire rate's helpful. Yeah, because it's allowing me to destroy the meteorites quicker. You gotta get down there because it's barraging me over here. Come on, Sylvester, let's destroy it. There we go. Now I just gotta worry about the meteorites. Meteors. I don't know why I keep calling meteorites. Alright, here we go. Oh, here we go. Interesting ships. I'm gonna destroy them because they might give me more stuff, maybe. I don't know. Oh, hey, look, there's the blue planet and the red planet again. Uh, where's the heal bug when you need one? Oh, now they're coming from behind. Lovely. Dodge from behind. Ah. Screw you. Not gonna make it! Mm. <sighs> damn it. Damn it, damn it. Damn me. Yeah, I'll come back to it. All right, YouTube, that's it for Stellar Interface again. I'm gonna come back to it later on. Maybe I'll get to a boss battle, I hope so. Like I said, check out the demo on Game Jolt. Stay tuned for the Steam game page for the early access. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Tom Trossi signing out. God love Stellar Interface. Space battles. Bye, guys.